Well, blessings, 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 beloved. I am Mama Pam, a.k.a. Hey, Pamela Dobson, and I do read 7 Minutes, beloved, every day, so you do not have to read. Today's read for Smurf and TikTok, the TikTokers. Today's read is for Tuesday, June the 21st, 2022, in the beginning, Genesis. Genesis 2, 10, 25, and 3, and 4. And Genesis 3, 12 reads, this is where man always cops up. And the man said, the woman whom thou gavest to be with me, she gave me of the tree, and I did eat. And they've been blaming it on us women ever since, but it ain't so, it ain't so. All right, reading from the King James Version of the Word of God, and it's Genesis, the second chapter, verses 10, and it reads, And a river went out of, the, went out of Eden to water the garden. And from thence it was parted and became into four heads. The name of the first is Pison, that is, it which passeth the whole land of Havilah, where there is gold. And the gold of that land is good. There is Bedulin and the onyx stone. And the name of the second river is Gihon. The same is it that compasses the whole land of Ethiopia. And the name of the third river is Hidekel. That is it which goes towards the east of Assyria. And the fourth river is Euphrates. And the Lord God took the man and put him into the garden of Eden to dress it and to keep it. And the Lord God commanded the man, saying, Of every tree of the garden thou mayest freely eat. But of the tree of knowledge of good and evil thou shalt not eat of it. For in the day that thou eatest thereof thou shalt surely die. And the Lord God said, it's not good that the man should be alone. So I will make him a help me for him. And out of the ground, the Lord God formed every beast of the field and every fowl of the air and brought them unto Adam to see what he would call them. And whatever Adam called every living creature, that was the name thereof. And Adam gave names to all cattle and to the fowl of the air and to every beast of the field. But for Adam, there was not found to help me for him. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam, and he slept, and he took out of his ribs and closed up the flesh instead thereof. And the rib which the Lord God had taken from man made he a woman, and brought her unto the man. This is marriage, you guys, not a marriage certificate. Sex is marriage. And Adam said, This is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. He, she shall be called woman, which she was taken out of man. Therefore shall a man leave his father, and he got to leave his mother. And he got to cleave unto his wife, and they shall be one flesh. And they were both naked, the man and his wife. And they were not ashamed. Chapter 3. Now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field. See, it says beast. I believe the serpent was a beast with four legs standing up. That's what I think. Because it says any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. And he said unto the woman, Yea, hath God said, Ye shall not eat of every tree of the garden? And the woman said unto the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees of the garden. But of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden... God hath said, Ye shall not eat of it, neither shall ye touch it, lest ye die. And the serpent said unto the woman, Ye shall not surely die. For God doth know that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be open, and ye shall be as little gods, knowing good and evil. And when the woman saw that the tree was good for food and that it was pleasant to the eyes and a tree to be desired to make one wise, she took of the fruit thereof and did eat and gave also to her husband who was with her. That boy right there with that devil talking to her. And he did eat. And the eyes of them both were opened and they knew that they were naked. First thing when you get knowledge is you put clothes on. And they sewed fig leaves together and made themselves aprons. And they heard the voice of the Lord walking in the garden in the cool of the day. And Adam and his wife hid themselves from the presence of the Lord God amongst the trees of the garden. And the Lord God called unto Adam and said unto him, Where art thou? 
And he said, I heard that voice in the garden. And, and I was afraid because cause I was naked and I hid myself. And he said, who told thee that thou was naked? Hast thou eaten of the tree whereof I commanded thee that thou shouldest not eat? And the man said, the woman whom thou gavest to me, she gave me of the tree and I did eat it. I ate it dark. And the Lord said unto the woman, What is this that thou hast done? And the woman said, The serpent beguiled me, and I did eat. The Lord God said unto the serpent, Because thou hast done this, thou art cursed above cattle. See, it looks like it was something with four legs, a curse above cattle and above every beast of the field. So he was one of them animals, because the curse was that he got a crawl. So the legs had to disappear. So upon thy belly shalt thou go, and dust shalt thou eat all the days of thy life. And I will put enmity between thee and the woman, and between thy seed and her seed. It shall bruise thy head, and thou shalt bruise his heel. Unto the woman, he said, I will greatly multiply thy sorrow and thy conception. In sorrow thou shalt bring forth children, and thy desire shall be to thy husband, and he shall rule over thee. Rulership of the men over women is a curse. It was not the original intent. And unto Adam, he said, because thou hast hearkened unto the voice of thy wife, and hast eaten of the tree of which I commanded thee, saying, thou shalt not eat of it. Cursed is the ground for thy sake. In sorrow shalt thou eat of it all the days of thy life. Thorns also and thistles shall it bring forth to thee, and thou shalt eat the herb of the field. So in the sweat of thy face shalt thou eat bread till thou return unto the ground. For out of it was thou taken, for dust thou art, and unto dust shalt thou return. And Adam called his wife Eve, called his wife's name Eve, because she was the mother of all living. And unto Adam also and to his wife did the Lord God make coats of skins and clothe them. When you have senses, you put clothes on. And the Lord said, Behold, a man is become as one of us, to know good and evil. And now at least he put forth his hand and take also of the tree of life and eat and live forever. Therefore the Lord God sent him forth from the Garden of Eden to till the ground from whence he was taken. So he drove out the man, and he placed at the east of the Garden of Eden cherubims and a flaming sword, which turned every way to keep the way of the tree of life so nobody could get to that tree of life. I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for being a part of the Smurf International Ministry. We do broadcast across the across the world, not just the United States, across the world. We are 7 Minute Read family, 7 Minute Read follows, just 7 Minute Read faithful folk. I am Minister Mama Pam, and any donation that the Lord lays upon your heart to bless us with, feel free, free, feel free to do that. I only ask for $7. <laughs> Send to dollar sign Mama Pam 23, paypal.me forward slash Pamela Dobson, and Zell is for Mackenzie Scott. Mackenzie Scott, aka used to be Bezo. I'm looking for $7 million to help me formulate, get started up, set up a transitional home for young girls here in Texas where there's not any homes, not enough for little dark girls, little girls with color, little color skin girls like myself. I'm 70 years old and well qualified and able to nurse, nurture and, and help grow these young women, preferably little girls with children, with babies. Teach them how to be mothers and how to go on to school and get their education and be successful women in society and awesome mothers to their children. So again, we are Smurf International Ministry. We do broadcast Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, live on Facebook and Insta, uh, Facebook and YouTube always. Facebook and YouTube, find me under the name of Pamela Dobson. Look for Pamela Dobson and you will see the current broadcast. And this evening, you will be seeing this broadcast live. Join us. Join us. TikTokers, okay, it's time to get off the clock. I love you all. God bless.